Christopher Reeve's friendship with Robin Williams is like no other, according to the former son Will Reeve. Our dad and Robin had a singular bond, the 32-year-old producer said. They had a friendship that someone should make a movie about, but what shone through that was just their love and respect for each other, and that never wavered. Robin was dad's best friend, and you show up for your friends, Will told people. He pointed out that Robin was the first friend to show up at the Virginia hospital after his dad fell from a horse in 1995, leaving Christopher, who died from heart failure at age 52, to be paralyzed from the neck down. No one was better at showing up with love and with the right dose of humor than Robin Williams and his wife Marcia, who we call our fairy godmother, Will said, adding, we are still so incredibly close with her. Reflecting on the two's extraordinary friendship, Journalist Rob Shooter shared a hilarious story about how the Mrs. Doubtfire actor cheered up his friend following his tragic accident, as OK previously reported. Robin felt partially responsible for not having done enough to save his friend John Belushi, so when he entered the hospital room for Christopher Reeve, he dressed up as a German doctor. He had a thick accent, Rob spilled. He insisted that Christopher Reeve turn over and have an exam, a proctology exam. Reeve was really, really surprised. He couldn't figure it out, the columnist continued. Then he finally realized this was his mate, this was Robin Williams. The two of them had a great laugh, maybe the first laugh since the accident occurred. Moments like these are part of what made their relationship so special, and it is captured in the new documentary Super Slash Man, the Christopher Reeves story, which debuted at the Sundance Film Festival in January. Reeves' friendship with the Patch Adams actor, who took his own life in 2014 at age 63, plays a key part in the film, which is directed by Ian Benote and Peter Edetge. The documentary also features memories from Christopher's friends, including Jeff Daniels, Whoopi Goldberg, Susan Sarandon, and Glenn Close, who touched on the two deceased actors' friendship. I've always felt that if Chris was still around Robin would still be alive, the 76-year-old Fatal Attraction star said. Their friendship, their connection, is the stuff of legend.